multi-region access points is a global endpoint to route requests to multiple buckets residing in different regions. So imagine you have two buckets and uh, you have bi-directional replication on them. You can have whatever replication you want on them, but usually that's a good pairing with this. And you want to uh, serve data uh, that is going to provide the lowest latency. And so we have this uh, customer that's from the, uh, the US, but to make this diagram work, because I made a mistake and I shouldn't have called it US East One, I should have called it some other place. Let's just pretend that this person lives over the border, uh, like on the border of Canada and the town across from is Montreal. It would make more sense to route them to CA Central, that's where that is in Montreal, than to US East One, which is in North Virginia. So that's what this can facilitate. If this sounds a lot like Abus Global Accelerator, that is because it is underneath, that is what it's using. Uh, if you're not familiar with Abus Global Accelerator, which we cover in uh, networking sections, it basically is going to uh, route things to the closest location. And so that is what it's utilizing underneath. And uh, it's very common to use S3 replication rules alongside with multi-region access points uh, because you generally are trying to give a copy of data um, uh, somewhere else. And so bi-directional or cross-region replication is what you'll normally use with this, okay?